Hi, this is Paula Asher, and we're going to talk about how to enroll and find users in Moodle. The first thing to do if you want to find your students or other users in your class is go to Assign Roles. Normally, in a, if you're an instructor in a class, you're going to want to add the people in your class as a student. And now you can see um, we have one existing user over here, and these are all of the potential students. To add a student, there are a number of ways that you can that you can look for a student. You could, for example, put somebody's last name in. Okay, so now I've found Ron Watrous, and I can add him to the class. To add somebody to the class, click on the name and then click Add. And then, of course, if you want to get rid of a student, we can remove Ron. Okay, sometimes people have trouble finding students in this huge list of users. Another way that you can that look for a student is to put their email account name in, which is something they can often furnish you. So in this case, I'm going to put Ron's email address in. And there he is. So that's another way to find Ron. Another thing is students sometimes um, misinterpret surname. They don't know that they're next to surname when they're setting up their account that they're supposed to put their last name in. And so another thing, another way that you can find students in your class is to put their first name in. So here you can see I searched under Ron and I have a whole list of students uh, with the first name Ron. The, the policy or procedure at the college is that the first and last names of Moodle accounts need to match the name of the CGCC student account. Now, so if you've gone to the trouble of finding a student and they and you can see from their Moodle account that they have their name put in, in incorrectly into Moodle, you can still put them in your class, but you want to let them know that their CGCC student ac account name may not match their Moodle account name and then they need to update their personal information. Well, I hope this video has been helpful to you and please let us know if we can assist you in any way.